Hey guys and girls, in this video, we're going to take a look at the best mid-range smartphones. This list is based on my personal opinion and tons of research, and I've listed products based on quality, durability, price, and more. I've included options for every type of consumer, so if you're looking for an entry-level option or the best product money can buy, we'll have the product for you in this list. If you want more information and updated pricing on the products mentioned, be sure to check the links in the description down below. The products mentioned are in no exact order, so be sure to stay till the end so you don't miss anything. Also, if you want a chance to win one of the smartphones in the video, just subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell and leave a comment with a hidden word in the video. Once we reach 1000 likes, we will pick a winner and notify him. Okay, so without further ado, this is our pick of the best mid-range smartphones on the market right now. Coming in number 7, we've got the Red Magic 3. The Red Magic 3 joins a growing contingent of smartphones designed specifically for gaming, rivaling the likes of the Black Shark 2, Asus ROG Phone, and Razer Phone 2. This handset has plenty of specs. With Snapdragon 855 processor, up to 12 gigabytes of RAM, and an Adreno 640 GPU, and Creator Nubia has included an extra feature to blow its competitors away, fitting a turbo fan for active cooling. Throw in an enormous battery, built-in compactive shoulder triggers, and RGB light strip, and a fiercely competitive price, you've got one of the best gaming smartphones currently available. The 6.65-inch display means the Red Magic 3 is a hefty piece of kit, but it also provides a lovely widescreen visual feast. A 90Hz refresh rate ensures a super smooth visual performance for fast-paced games. This puts the Red Magic 3 ahead of the pack when it comes to competitors such as the Black Shark 2, which can only muster 60Hz, but can't quite match up to the 120Hz panels utilized by both the Razer Phone 2 and the Asus ROG Phone 2. Ultra-powerful components make the Red Magic 3 easily one of the most powerful Android phones available. And it's our pick for the best mid-range phone for gaming. Number 6. Samsung Galaxy A51 The Samsung Galaxy A51 has a sleek, eye-catching design that catches the light for a premium-looking finish, along with handy extras like a headphone jack and a micro SD card slot. But it offers far more than just that. The 6.5-inch OLED screen is a joy to use for watching your favorite videos with a sharp resolution and great colors and contrast. Its four-lens camera offers great versatility at this price with the option to use wide-angle, ultra-wide, and telephoto lenses for smart, sharp shots. On the other hand, the battery was a little underwhelming, despite its promising 4000 mAh capacity. In our benchmark tests, the processor didn't exactly hold its own in comparison to rivals. Coming in at number 5, Google Pixel 3a. The Google Pixel 3a is comfortably one of the best phones you can buy for $399. There's much to like about it on all fronts. The highlight is the camera, and while you'll find phones with more megapixels out there, unless you pay a lot more, you won't get snaps this good. Like the much pricier Pixel 3, the 3a packs a 12 megapixel f1.8 camera with a load of Google's excellent AI software on board. The Pixel 3a's screen is superb too. It's an OLED panel with punchy colors, excellent viewing angles, and no notch to speak of. There are compromises in some areas, however. There's no IP rating or wireless charging. The mid-range Snapdragon 670 chipset is merely okay, and the body is made of plastic. If you want every spec and feature going, you'll probably want to look elsewhere, to the Xiaomi Mi 9, for example. Coming at number 4, Xiaomi Mi Note 10. Xiaomi Mi Note 10 is a mid-range phone with some high-end device design traits. It packs five cameras, a main 108-megapixel sensor, and a generously-sized battery that lasts pretty well. In some areas, Xiaomi Mi Note 10 is made to the same standard as a phone costing twice as much. Its sides are metal, and both the front and rear of the device are substantial, curved pieces of glass. The Mi Note 10 has a 6.47-inch screen, an OLED panel with a 2340 by 1080 pixel resolution, excellent for the money. 
You may find larger, but you won't find much better, particularly if the curvy front appeals. Day-to-day -day performance is technically sound, as you'd hope, from a device with a good CPU and 6GB of RAM. This isn't the most polished smartphone on the market, the camera is slow, it isn't the most attractive phone despite all that curved glass, and fingerprint scanner performance is poor. However, you do get plenty of hardware for your money, and despite its flaws, the Xiaomi Mi Note 10 offers good value. Number 3. Xiaomi Mi 9T Pro The Mi 9T Pro seems almost too good to be true. With this model, Xiaomi rivals the Honor 20 and OnePlus 7, offering flagship specs and slick design at a mid-price range. Unlike the competition, however, the Mi 9T Pro has a headphone jack, not to mention a Super AMOLED Full HD Plus full-screen display, meaning that there are no notches or hole punches in sight. At just 399 pounds, this phone is significantly better than any other similarly priced devices packing flagship specs. Performance in general is excellent, particularly the gaming experience. A Snapdragon 855 processor coupled with 6GB of RAM lets this phone power through benchmarks and gamers alike. While it doesn't quite stack up against the cream of the current crop of dedicated gaming phones, it doesn't fall far short. And compared to the best of 2018, the Razer Phone 2 and Asus ROG Phone, the Mi 9T Pro wins out. If you need a new phone that won't break the bank, Xiaomi Mi 9T is one of the easiest phones out now to recommend. It combines exceptional value for money with premium accessible design, powerful internals, and a very good stills and video camera. The phone's all-screen display and under-display fingerprint scanner are also highlights at this price, and it has a headphone jack, making it something of a unicorn among flagship spec devices available now. Coming at number two, OnePlus 8. OnePlus has traditionally produced real winners at this price point, and this year's model is no exception. Bringing 5G for a reasonable price, along with a top-class processor, ensures that this is one of the best mid-range choices for those seeking a powerhouse performance for less. In terms of sheer power, this will hold its own even among Android flagships, and the 5G capacity gives it some future-proofing too. On top of that, it's got a great screen that boasts vibrant colors, perfect contrast, and sharp resolution, all along with a 90Hz refresh rate that makes scrolling extra smooth and is a rare feature for the price. However, the camera isn't that great and there's no optical zoom for sharp close-up shots. What's more, while the premium models in the series finally got upgraded to have wireless charging and an IP rating, the OnePlus 8 still has to go without. Number 1. Xiaomi Mi 9 The Xiaomi Mi 9 is unquestionably a serious contender. It features Qualcomm's latest and greatest chipset, the Snapdragon 855, and packs in all sorts of other desirables, including fast wireless charging, HDR visuals, and a triple rear camera array headed up by a 48 megapixel primary sensor. While it has less of the cool factor than its rival OnePlus 7, which is similarly priced, the Mi 9 embodies the harder, better, faster, stronger mentality. It can hold its own against the might of Apple and Samsung at a much affordable price point and is definitely worth considering when you're seeking out a new smartphone. That brings us to the end of our review and buyer's guide for the best mid-range smartphones. Hope to see you in the next video. Let us know in the comments what is your favorite one. And if you like this content, don't forget to subscribe and get notified when we launch new videos. Thanks for watching. Peace.